Netflix canceled the animated Bone series? But here's the sad thing. It's not the first time something like that happened. The Bone creator responded with a new comic that just makes it more depressing. During the late 90s, Nickelodeon almost made a Bone movie. They wanted pop songs and to turn the source material into something a bit different, which the creator didn't like, and rightfully so. Around a decade later, Warner Bros. bought the movie rights, planning a few stories on the big screen. For whatever reason, these plans fell through when scripts kept getting rejected. And finally, Netflix announced a Bone cartoon in 2019, but we know how that turned out. Some pretty bad stuff is happening behind the scenes at Netflix's kids and family animation department, which led to Bones cancellation. For more than 20 years, Jeff Smith has been trying to get an adaptation of his work. Time and time again though, he's getting screwed over. Here's a new comic he posted in response to the whole thing. Hello, I'm Nickelodeon. I want to make an animated Bone movie. Um, okay. Yeah, let's make a movie. Ugh. Hi, I'm Warner Bros. We want to make an animated Bone movie. I don't know. Yeah, they're the makers of Bugs Bunny. Let's do it! Oh! Hello, we're Netflix. We want to make an animated Bone series. I don't know. Yeah, streaming is a whole new thing. It'll be different this time. Ugh! Never again. Hello, allow me to introduce myself. So this recaps his unfortunate attempts to try and get animated Bone. Jeff later clarified to a fan that he's not so much bummed out, just embarrassed that he keeps falling for it. But seriously, it's hard not to feel bad for him. His most well-known work has a massive cult following who would watch a cartoon, but higher-ups, well, they're not giving him a chance. At this point, we have to ask, is there anything the fans can do to help the creator? Actually, yeah. Number one, just spread the word about Bone. Express your frustration about all these cancellations. He does write, never again in the comic, but who knows, maybe the whole thing can find another home elsewhere, but that's only if companies are aware of the insane fan feedback. The second way to keep Jeff happy is by checking out his current comic series, Tuki. I want to publish my new project, Tuki Fight for Fire. It's like a 144 page uh, graphic novel. Even if you're not a big fan of Bone, I think it's important to support artists who don't get the best treatment. Even when it's someone like Jeff Smith, who's won a, a lot of awards, studios give him the short end of the stick. Now, it's up to the fans to help him out. In the meantime, maybe I'll finally try reading Bone. This whole situation got me in the mood. But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Give a thumbs up and come up below let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.